Casper Network. I know I've seen this coin around. It's in the top 100, right? Uh, circulating supply versus total supply. If this is true, which it looks like it is, it has infinite supply. That's not great, right? But it doesn't mean it can't appreciate in price. We have uh, Cosmos, which as well has basically infinite supply, the Atom token, right? It did well in the last bull market, but it didn't melt faces, right? And so if you have an infinite, infinite supply, right, the upside can be there, right? But it can be limited. And what we see so far here with Casper uh, is some downside because it did <coughs> basically come out at the peak of the bull market, drop down here, hit lows along with Ethereum, along with Bitcoin. And it's gone up here, it looks like from two and a half cents to six cents um, into May of this year, and then has kind of chilled out. So the chart's not terrible in terms of where it's been uh, right now. Uh, it's basically looks like it's flatlined to pretty good, came to the upside pretty decent. And so, yeah, it doesn't look like it's going to hit below <coughs> its current all-time low of 2.2 cents, right? It probably holds that low uh, as long as Bitcoin holds 20K. And so anywhere right now it's three and a half cents. So yeah, between two to three or four cents, right? That range there, you can buy it. And then if Casper does go above 20 cents, right? Which would already be a 10 X for you there almost depending on your average price. Then um, it's next challenge will be the all time high of $1.33. And if it can surpass both of those, great. But again, remember infinite supply. So that's not great, but it's not a deal killer as well. So let's take a quick at, look at the website. Uh, introducing the Casper network upgrade. The, this release marks the most significant update to the Casper blockchain since mainnet, introducing new uh, key new enterprise grade features that have been requested for the organization and people that are building on Casper. Uh, Casper is simple, built by developers, builders for builders. Casper is designed to accelerate uh, developer adoption on blockchain technology through Wasm code environment and open programming standards it is upgradable <coughs> excuse me i might have to go grab a cough drop here in a second a fully upgradable and secure modular network designed to grow and evolve casper is the most customizable blockchain on the market decentralized casper is an open permissionless proof of stake protocol um, fully decentralized uh, designed for performance at global scale so this doesn't sound like anything unique much um, the only thing that is interesting on this, in my opinion, just from the get-go, is that they want to increase adoption uh, technology through different coding environments, right? Um, it's interesting because Cardano, right, with the Haskell language, wants to make blockchain development easy as well. AVAX wants to do that too. Um, Cosmos wants to get that interoperability going. So there's a lot of projects trying to do this, and I think... Um, Casper, if they are collaborating with other projects, trying to use the best of both worlds, then it has a future. Um, if they're just like, we're the best coin and we're the best blockchain and we're going to beat Ethereum, um, probably <coughs> less likely to do well long term. So I don't know. I, the next thing I would want to look at is who's involved in the program. We don't have that information here, just have the general community. So I'd like to look at who built the project and things like this. Um, but yeah, it doesn't look uh totally bad but also doesn't really give me a, a lot of green lights right now so i might if i was looking at casper i'd be like okay i'll keep watching this for a while here and, and see how it goes but yeah my thoughts on that joe or, or jay um i'm more interested in ethereum to be honest